Hello Z-Bird, welcome back to Luigi's Mansion 3. Today, we are going somewhere. We unlocked a couple more floors in the last episode. I think we unlocked floor three in the last episode after defeating another ghost boss along with it. We unlocked this guy right here, Guiji, to help us out. And what I figured we would do before we get to floor three, can I get you to go away? How do I do that? Um. I don't know how I make him go away. I'm just gonna walk away. I think that maybe eventually he'll just sort of follow me. <laughs> yeah. Um, I wanted to go to this right here. Because I think this is how we get this gem. And it looks like I was correct. So what I've noticed that each floor has a different shaped gem type. And when it comes to the different colors in each gem, um, they're just throughout that floor. So that's what I've sort of figured out, of course. I don't know why it took me so long to figure that out, but I did it, so so we're good. Also, is there supposed to be, aha, look at this. What is this gonna be then? Um, maybe another gem, maybe not. Just a bunch of coins. All right, well remember, if something seems like it's missing, it might actually be missing, so always worth just messing around with some stuff. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, I think we're going to floor three. I might wanna go to the ground floor first, because I know there's another gem waiting there, but I don't know if I'll be able to figure that one out still. There's a couple of mysteries. I mean, actually, now with Guiji, I wonder if we can go into this area here. This feels like it's very circumstantially close. You'd think, no? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> look at this. Okay, can he slam onto the circuitry on the bottom? He can open this chest, that's for sure. Um, and that is a bunch of money. And then we can just go ahead and very easily grab this, right? Um, am I doing that wrong? Hmm. That doesn't work. That doesn't either. So you know what, it probably has to do with this thing right here. Uh, yep, just like that. It'll sort of have a little outline if you can do it that way. So maybe once we fix the generator, give it a little bit of a power surge, then we can get the gem. Excellent progress so far, that is for sure. So let's switch back to Luigi for now. Thank you for the help, Luigi. Um, hold on, there we go. <laughs> so the big question is then, um, I can't interact with this anymore, guess not. Um, the big question is, where are the other two, two gems on this floor? I know there was one in this car right there. Um, so Gooigi's sort of following me around, can I? Oh, look at this. Whoa, what is this about? Okay, well there are some proper secrets going on. I would like to get that spider before he gets away, but I guess it's too late. Oh well, uh, we'll explore this a little bit. There is a gem up there. Oh man, we're finding some major secrets to start things off today. I'm liking it. Uh, nothing over this way, right? Doesn't look like it. So we need to find a way to get up there. Maybe if I keep going this way for now, uh, we'll figure something out. I can get some coins, that's for sure. Major money. Luigi's just chilling out. It's weird that you can't make Luigi go away. In a, yeah, that's just really weird. Oh yeah, this is a staircase, that's good. Hmm. So let's just go up this way for now. And there is the gem, but how do we exactly grab it? That's the question. Huh. Um, I'm not entirely sure. This one might be a bit of a bit mystery for now. Uh, yeah, I, I don't see how I can get that one. Okay, well that's fine. I think that knowing that it's here, can I just walk up as Guiji? I can't, okay. Uh, knowing that it's here is like half the battle for some of these, of course. Uh, Guiji, could you move, please? All right. I don't. I, there must be a way to get rid of him. I guess not. Anyways, switch back to Luigi, and he'll just sort of teleport around, following me for the most part. Yeah. Um, I think sooner or later we'll find more stuff. I keep on getting the buttons confused though for uh, stuff for both. Um the plunger and the other thing. But anyways, we've already gone to the left. Let's go to the right. If we find any more along the way, awesome. Yeah, this thing's just sitting here. I've already gotten it. But there's one out of the other two gems we're missing. So I guess the other one would probably be on the staircase over this way. Not the staircase, ooh. Um, we, could, we could take a quick peek. I mean, we've already taken a look at that. So unless I can, that actually worked. Um, hold on. Whoa, -ho -ho! maybe that's when I messed up on floor five. I wasn't aiming that correctly. Uh, maybe we should take a look at that again too. Is there something this way? Aha. So what's going on with the, all of this? First off, we got some money. 
and a golden spider, which will give me a ton of cash as well. Uh, over this way, a bunch of other stuff. Maybe I can get rid of it one way or another. So besides this uh, thing right here though, I'm not exactly finding what I was hoping for in this room, which was of course a gem. A little surprising. So unless I can, yeah, I can't suction that off. Still don't exactly know what's going on, and I guess I could have already taken a peek at that by looking through that hole. I really gotta start routinely doing that a bit more. Um, I already found this treasure chest in the past, as you can already see. So, I don't entirely know what else there could be. I, I guess we'll find out later on, but let's go up to the ground floor, which is right over this way. Yeah, as you can see, it should be giving us a different map. Oh, it must be that down there. You can see it, actually. Yeah, I remember that. There must be some kind of like flying mechanism at some point, or something with these grates, because that's now the second gem we found that we couldn't quite reach. And then there's also this, which I guess for this one, we can uh, grab this, pull it back, and give it a slam. So we're doing a little bit of gem collecting to start today's episode off. It's pretty cool. Got it indeed. So that's our second like diamond shaped one. Can I look through this hole? You bet I can. Oh, so there's definitely something going on here. This looks like the same spot as before. Hmm. Maybe that's something to keep a to keep an eye on. Is there some ghosts in here? I'll have to be careful of that. Seems like there might be. Hmm. Can I do anything with this picture? Nope. I also just have to look around for anything I can put the... Aha! Look at this! That's gotta be something. Whoa! 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 Look at that! That's so awesome! Yeah, I guess this place must be jam-packed with gems. Because of the fact that they all have to be on this floor, there should be three more to get somewhere around here. So we'll keep poking around. Can I just... Oh my gosh, Luigi! You got quite a walk going on if you could just smash through things like that. I wish I could just leave. I mean, I don't want to, I want to go save Mario and everything. Wait, can I? Uh, yeah. Hit this stuff. What'll that do? Oh, I'll make a bunch of money. I don't know if that was appropriate to do. Now we'll never know if we, if we found Toad or not. <laughs> but I might as well. It'd be so cool. I don't know if this is the case, it probably isn't. How cool would it be that if with each character you save, you could actually play as them? Like, like once you like save Mario, you can play as Mario. That would be awesome. I, I'm not expecting it, because that'd also be a little weird. Because, you know, most of these games so far have been save Mario. Luigi's Mansion 1 and 2 was about saving Mario. Um, but you never know. Anyways, let's go ahead and keep busting these, because it's actually getting me free stuff. Uh, if I can, being a little picky with me right now. Oh, there is a ghost up there, so we'll definitely have to deal with him. But for right now, if I can get some extra cash, that will be awesome. Okay, so we're over $8,000, and we still haven't found a way to even spend our money. It's a weird thing. Okay, it looks like I, yeah, I wasted one of the pumpkins, unfortunately, so unless I could find another pumpkin, I guess the Princess Peach one will stand. So how am I getting this? This I still haven't figured out. Oh, maybe it's the phone. Oh, there's a ghost just chilling over there. Hold on, hold on. Let's get him. Got him, okay, you get over here. Ooh, ready, boom, got him, got him, one more time, that's it. Great stuff. Okay, so far, it's been very interesting. I know of this one gem, but I just don't know how to get it, you know? Because with all of them so far, if I can shoot something at it, we already tried this, it'll have something significant sort of tied to it. Like it'll actually point itself to there pretty easily. Like we see that here. You see how it does that? I'm not really aiming at that very well. The game just sort of does it for me. Oh, that one actually gave me a little extra. <laughs> of course, because she's royalty. Anyways, grab all the dollar bills. And hopefully over time we can figure it out. Right now I could go back this way again. I don't think there's anything more. Unless I can like put the su suction cup. I don't know why I always want to call it that. It's a plunger. Uh, anywhere fancy. I mean, I've already gotten the gem here, haven't I? Didn't this lead to a gem? I think it did. Yeah, okay, so don't have to worry about that. We've already found that one. Um, 
what is going on up here? Because I feel like we can explore this a tad bit more. And I mean, there's more floors beyond that too, or more rooms, so. I don't know, maybe I'll be a bit sidetracked for now. We can keep poking around later on. Um, I think it's about time that we, well, hold on. I'm really curious about this. <laughs> really fast, can we break that? We can. And this is like a, a dinner room. Whoa. I'm sure that we're going to have to come here for something at some point, so I, I wanna leave it be. But let's go to where we're supposed to go. As you can see, it is explore the hotel shops, which I guess is on floor three. Alrighty. You know, for being a very big hotel, very few of the floors so far have actually been for people staying there. I mean, I mean, obviously the, the stores are, but like for people to actually sleep here, which is the main point of a hotel. Anyways, uh, we're going to floor three. Hopefully things go well. I found a couple of gems there, so I'm, I'm pretty happy with our progress. If we keep chipping away at, the, at it like that each episode, I'm sure sooner or later we'll find most of our stuff. Ooh, floor three. <laughs> what is he doing? Are you trying to blind yourself? It's not gonna be very helpful. Guess maybe he's trying to look scary, so maybe he scares the ghosts away. Anyways, according to the sign to the right, there's actually some ghost coffee we can find. Let's take a look at the map. Uh, this is a little of a weird angle. So it looks like there's a gem store, coffee. Oh, that's probably like jewelry, gotcha. Uh, presents, like a gift shop, hair cutting, and um, I guess clothes. Cool. So let's see what is in this one, if I can open it up. Nope, that's locked. We need a key. Gotcha. So we'll be back for that. Is there anything over here that's supposed to? It's a little barren, but I guess not. And as you can see, different. Oh, maybe it's a perfume store? Oh no, bathrooms are out of order. That's not good. Hopefully Luigi doesn't have to go. Okay, well, no, the men's is available. All right. Huh. Uh, what's with this ominous golden glowing one? I don't know if I should have just checked the door first, but we're just gonna rip it open. Oh, hey, there's the key. Great. Um, no, don't flush it. <laughs> that won't help. There we go. We got it. Not bad. And what about this present, or not present, picture? Can't do anything with that. But I can give this a good slam. That just made a big mess. I <laughs> didn't do anything but make a big mess. So this one is actually locked. Oh my, <laughs> it's not a real ghost. Don't worry, Luigi. It's just a toy. Just made the spook ya. Okay, so when it comes to using the plunger, obviously we can use it right there. Is there anything else? Doesn't look like it. Okay, I can only do one plunger at a time. Let's try this then. Ooh, what is this? Is it a pipe? All right, Luigi, you know what to do. Go down that pipe. Whoa, the, he can actually do that. Whoa. He's more of a plumber than Luigi. Speaking of plumber, we're gonna need one for this room. Turn on the sink. Is that still running? No, somebody clogged coins down here. Well, we found the source of the leak. Don't go down that way, I'm not done. Um, no, yeah, that's right. Doesn't work that way. Um, let's try that again then, real quick. I don't know if there's much we can do with it being right here that the problem is going on. Can't open that. Yeah, as long as this leak is going on, we can't get that purple gem over there. Gotcha. All right, see you, Luigi. <laughs> Maybe he'll teleport over. And what's going on down this way? Not much of anything, another telephone we can interact with. All of these have had no answer so far. Can't order any room service, unfortunately. So I still can't go in from this way, unless I can maybe do something with the sign. It sort of floats around a little bit like I can, but I can't. All right, well, we have the key now. So I guess that's sort of the entryway to the shops is right here. Gotcha, I understand a bit more. Okay. Well, luckily we have a lot of money, so maybe we can actually spend it here. Whoa. <laughs> I think you revolved too much around that revolving door. Oh, what's going on? Uh. Oh, it's like a security officer. <laughs> and he has, oh, another button for the for the uh, elevator. What is he getting spooked by? He's the ghost. <laughs> He's on the case. Who's making a mess in the, the shopping hall? 
Somebody behind the vending machine. Or maybe it is the vending machine. Ah! It's just a little mouse. And I guess he's going in that room. Ooh, that's a fancy key. All right, we'll have to go and get that. Maybe that's what opens up rooms like these. I'm not really sure. Uh, we can check the trash can though. It has one dollar. Awesome. And then if I do this, I wonder if it'll get me any extra? No. <laughs> There's a bunch of gross stuff. And nothing with this. Okay. I'm just sort of checking whatever I can for now. What was that? There was definitely something in the barber shop. Yeah, you can see a little ghost floating around. Luigi, did you see that? That security guard had an elevator button. Yep. Oh, here we go. No, no, that didn't work. Uh, it looks like he went into the security office. Follow him, go. I will, I will. I was just sort of checking out the barber shop. Can't do much there. So. Ooh, this area is very crowded. We got a nice little cafe. I like it. Can I hop over anything here? Wow. I can make all the donuts fly everywhere. The cop's not gonna like that. Uh, but, can't do much with any of this. Uh, what is this? Oh, there's supposed to be a ladder here. And now there is. Very cool. Okay, well first we gotta do all this. Luigi, did you see that? I know, he's so impatient with me. So impatient. Oh, there's more? Oh, this one's like way far out there. Come back, come back. Uh, oh, yeah. I will soon enough, Egad. Yeah. Right now, I'm exploring. Uh, oh. I gotta check all this out. Uh, got it. So up this way, well first off, there's a bat. Gotcha. <laughs> and what's going on over here? More bats! They're everywhere, I tell you. Ow, ow, ow. Uh, there we go, I think I got all of them. <laughs> No, I didn't, no I didn't. It's hard to tell which angle I'm facing, but I think I got it. There's a couple more dollars we can grab. I hear something, like glowing. Oh, it's his treasure chest and more bats. Hold on, Egad, I get it, I get it. I'm being swarmed by bats at the moment, I hope you know. Oh, there we go, I gotta do that. Uh, Okay, I got the gem, <laughs> everything's going great. I just gotta get these bats away from me, they're evil. They're out to get me. Come on, can I get this dollar bill or no? There we go. There's a couple, but I, I just can't get them. <laughs> I tried, I tried. All right, well, very interesting so far. Doesn't look like I'm getting entrance to any of these shops so far either, but that's okay. We'll, we'll get away into there sooner or later. For right now, I think it'll just be best to poke around a little bit. I don't know what that glowing noise is. It must just be the key, so let's go find out. I know, Egad, calm down. Oh, can I poke my head into here? Oh, there he is, what's he doing? He's just reading a little bit, checking out his button. Well, it's gonna be our button soon, hopefully. Let's grab the key, nice. So what is this for? Who knows? Oh yeah, and the, the, the creepy vending machine. Really wasn't much, huh? Okay, this time it gave me a heart. I didn't realize it could give me multiple things. Okay, we'll just keep flashing it until I get more stuff. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Anything else? Oh, more mice, more mice. Boom, that's a lot of money. And boom, anything else? Hey, look at that! All right, that's the blue one. I wasn't expecting that, to be honest with you. And what will it give me now if I try? Nothing. Okay, can we get rid of this as well? Yeah. Whoa, ooh, what if we did that? We might have not got not have gotten the gem at all. That would have been bad. Is there any way I can bring it back or anything? Doesn't look like it. And lastly, yeah. So maybe with that key, I guess I can put it in here. So we very quickly used this key, but it doesn't work. Oh, maybe it's the shape. We got a diamond shape and a star. That won't match up at all. So what door has a diamond shape on it? I'll have to go and find out. Because most of these doors, they, as you can see, they have symbols right next to them. Like this one has a, yeah, not gonna really match up, does it? That is a, is that a, a spade or a club? 
I think that's the spade, yeah. Uh, I hope Luigi has been very helpful for you, Luigi. Oh, yeah, duh! <laughs> Don't forget that he can move through the tight spaces. Don't be afraid to use him. So we can, as you see, he can use it, and he can just go right through. As easy as that. Silly me. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at all this cool boo memorabilia. Wish I had this in real life, I would totally get it. Especially that backpack was really cool. Um, there's some gold bars, nice. And oh, look at the King Boo slippers. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I love the piranha plant stuff up here too. Uh, anything I can do with this, whoa, whoa. Okay, there's a little mouse. Oh, he is fast. Oh, they're all fast. Ah. I'm not doing a very good job. Okay, here we go, ready? I got one of them. I got the other one. At least it was some money. <laughs> Didn't know what to expect from that. Very interesting effect for sure. Uh, grab these gold bars before they disappear. There we go. And also, get rid of every single pose card I can. There we go, just wanna make a big, big mess of the place. So I can't do anything with this as you can see because our key just won't match up. Nope, not happening. So once again, it's all about the shapes. But in the meantime, there's plenty more for us to do. Uh, if we go this way, we're in the little barista area. Turn on the sink. Every time we try this, every once in a while, gives us a little more than the water. What about this? Ooh. Oh, hey! Oh, hey, it's a golden ghost! I guess they have those in this game, too. Wait, no, 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 wait, you come back here. You're trying to leave? Not without me shaking a little money from you. Thank you very much. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's like super gone. Can't quite get him. Well, I mean, he's right here, apparently. Oh, there he is. Come back. Come back. That's it. Oh, now you're in trouble. Now you're in trouble. The power of Gooigi is gonna get you. Okay, he's down to like 20 health. Pretty cool. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You're, you're, you're done. You're finished. You're finished. Boom. Look at that. Tons of cash from him. So I guess we gotta look around for golden ghosts as well. Got a couple more dollar bills. The gold bars are important as well. I think that's on the other side. Let me run over there really quickly before all this disappears. There we go. And what's with this? Did I actually turn this on? It's like a little coffee machine. I guess I did. So that just gave me money. Still worth getting though, for sure. Not really too much else to find around here though. Hmm. I'll definitely take all these treats. Luigi might be made of goo, but that doesn't mean he doesn't like a good dessert every once in a while. Okay, there's a gold bar in there. What about in this one? Couple dollar bills. Okay, awesome. I think that's it for this room now. So what I might wanna do is leave for now and we'll, we'll go to the other room. Hope that there is a key for that one. Because if not, I actually don't know what to do. So down, well there's also two rooms down below. So this is it, right here, okay. This is the diamond. That definitely matches up. All right, Luigi, would you wanna follow us? I guess he's sort of knocked out at the moment. We'll just go into here. Oh, so this is like the, the jewelry and apparel room. Can I get rid of this stuff? Boom. That didn't actually do much. Huh. Whoa, <laughs> this thing is like too big. I mean, I got rid of the stuff on the pedestal. I don't know if that actually did anything. Oh, what's going on with that hat up there? There's like, oh, there's coins under the top hat. Gotcha. Oh, there's a gem in there. I wonder if I can hit this in any way. Not yet. I'll figure that out. For right now, let's go ahead and activate this cash register. So this might get us some extra money, but more importantly, gets us a key. And a ghost, watch out, Gooigi. Oh. Nope, not gonna work on him. Hey now, hey, wait, come back. <laughs> so Luigi's not really phased by much, of course. Sort of the opposite of Luigi, of course, he's phased by everything. Poor guy's always afraid. There we go, ready? But well, that was cool, did you see that? I actually hit one ghost with the other ghost. I didn't even realize I was doing that. Whoa, hold on, I can hit them into the thing. I got it, I got it, okay. So, hopefully we can do that over here, ready? Ready, ready, oh, I couldn't end up doing it, darn. I hope that doesn't mean I missed out on my chance. Because I realized I can slam into this and it broke it. 
maybe, oh, that's what the plunger is for for these suitcases and why they don't break. I understand now. So we are going to cause some massive property damage here. I mean, to be honest with you, they, they put our friends in the paintings. I, th I think it, you know, it comes around, goes around. And boom, wow. Just watch out, Luigi, you don't wanna get scratched. I mean, you're made out of goo, so maybe you wanna affect you very much. One more time now. And right over this way. <laughs> That's so satisfying every time. Um, so there is the yellow gem. Not bad, not bad at all. The only question now is why is this wall slightly miscolored? I don't know. Sort of like that on this side too. Maybe it's just old wallpaper. I don't think there's too much more to do in this room then. We actually properly cleared this one out. Might as well take as much as we can though. I'm sure EGAD can make a use of it. See, there is that done. So we got the heart, which can be used down this way. Because on playing cards, which is this is a reference to, on playing cards there's four different symbols, right? There's a heart, diamond, a spade, and club. So the one on the left here, that's a club. This is obviously a heart. On the top left was the diamond. On the top right was the spade. Yeah. Okay, so what's going on over this way? So far, we got a couple of things we can beat up and just sort of steal from. So this is the clothing store. There's a little, what will this do? Oh, it's like the changing booth. You're beautiful. And you're also gonna get captured. <laughs> Are you so embarrassed? Okay, where'd he go? Where'd he go? I'm ready for you. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe I'm not. There we go. Come on, get him. And slam. Keep slamming. Nice. Okay, it was only one ghost. That was quite easy to deal with then. And got a little bit of money here and there. So there's still more we can poke around with. First, let's just take all the clothes we can. Maybe one of these will be hiding something, and if not, maybe there's something behind all this. Doesn't look like it for that idea, but hey, it does give me money for collecting and all. That's cool. I really like games that, of course, reward you for exploring and poking around with as much stuff as possible. So I can push this mirror around, but it doesn't do much. Can't really do anything else with it. Uh, okay. Um. Anything else I can do around here? No, 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 I've already gotten that. I guess I can take the dresses off the mannequins. What is that? Is that for a plunger? That is for a plunger. And boom, okay, that just gave me some money. And what about this one? I'm guessing more of the same. Looks like, oh, there was a golden bat. I would, I, I really hope nobody bought, bought a dress and there was a bat inside. I thought that'd be an unpleasant surprise. Yeah, it's like a little bat cage, you can see it. And that one didn't really have much. Okay, uh, there's still a couple more things we can poke around with. Oh, what is with this one? This one definitely has some kind of hidden function. You can see the gears. All right, whoa. Oh, that opened a secret door. Oh, that is so cool. We'll be there in a moment. First, let's open this one where we'll presumably get another key. And we get the spade this time. I will happily grab that whenever it's done floating around. Uh-oh, where'd it go? What? Come back here. Can I open this up? Oh, I don't know what that went. We'll have to figure that out for right now. Aha, behind the register. Will that open a secret room? Whoa! Whoa! That's a lot of money. Whoa, he's tiny. What is he doing? Oh my gosh, there's a lot of them. There's a colony. Oh no. Oh gosh, I'm surrounded. Uh. Let's try to angle ourselves at just the right spot and get like all of them. Oh my gosh, that was crazy. But there's still more. Uh, there we go. And that was it. <laughs> so there we go, we got it. That was that was very interesting. So I had like 9,800 coins before I go into this room. How many am, go am I going to have after vacuuming all these up? Uh, about like two or 300 more. So that was quite a lot of coins. Because each coin only gives you one gold. Keep that in mind. We'll grab all this stuff, even though it doesn't seem to be doing much for me. What about this? This seems oddly stagnant. 
as if maybe I could do more with it, but I guess not. And what about this one? Nope, there's just like different types of fabrics, but I do see this, which I can definitely interact with. Just trying to find the last couple of gems while I have the chance, always worth it to explore thoroughly. Not much though, not much. Anyways, we never went into the secret room where there is indeed a gem right up that way. We'll grab that in a second. First, let's grab what's immediately in front of us. So can I get this? There it goes. Uh, there we go, I was having a hard time running into it. So that is our fourth gem on this floor. We are making amazing progress. And besides that one gold bar, I don't think there's anything else in here. So we are going to leave and head back out this way. So we have the spade one, so we need to go back up here really quick. And there we go. Wait, no, yeah, we've already gone through this room. Uh, for a second, I got a little confused. Uh, but we didn't activate it. Oh no, hey, give that back. Luckily, we have our handy dandy dark light. We'll just grab those really quickly. Oh, hey, that scared me. Luigi just popped up in the corner like that. I was like, whoa, I'm seeing double. As you can see, that will be hopefully our final key. Yep, there's the clubs. I'll grab that real fast. We're already done with this room, so we should be able to speed through it. Whoa, maybe I spoke too soon. Oh, is it another one of these, these ghosts with glasses? We saw some of these guys in Luigi's Mansion too, but they were green. Now they're blue. Yeah, definitely the colors have changed since that game. Anyways, yeah, we need to we need to take the glasses first, then we can hit him with a flashlight, because if not, he won't see the light, because he has sunglasses on. Why is this not working? There we go, come on. Slam him around. Nice, okay, oh, there's more. Oh, there's a bunch of small guys again. We'll deal with them. Got him. Now let's get to this angle to get rid of that, please, and thank you. Come on. There it is. We should, oh my gosh, destroyed the entire shelf there. Poor piranha plants, fall in the shambles. Okay, well there's that room completed. So far I feel like we're doing a pretty clean sweeping of the entire store. <laughs> Whoa, what happened here? Oh my gosh. While Luigi was napping, they're pulling little pranks on him. Whoa, whoa, look at this. Wait, what's with the ominous laugh? <laughs> Feast your eyes on the escalator. You'll get so lazy from never using the steps that Luigi will get overweight and he'll never be able to defeat the ghosts. Is that their evil plan? I don't know. Oh, hey, yeah, that's right. This door doesn't open. Hmm, I think this calls for Luigi. Let's go ahead and grab him real quick. So I still haven't quite figured this out then. Hmm. I can't quite go in. Well, these almost look like propellers up there. Aha! That's so cool! Oh, you know what? Look at this! Oh, that's awesome! We got some teamwork going on. They're a ghost catching team. Wait, am I doing it the wrong way? I think I might be doing it the wrong way. I guess I was supposed to suck and not push. There we go. Wait, it didn't work this time. Oh, I, I had it wrong. Oh, look at this! Perfect. <laughs> Luigi put his, his thumbs up too. He looked a little confused now. Um, let's go through with Luigi. Man, this is just Luigi's episode. It's his time to shine. So where is this hair cutter guy? I'm gonna take his scissors so he can't use those. Shouldn't be flying with scissors. If he can't run with scissors, he definitely shouldn't fly with scissors. <laughs> Lots of pictures on mustaches. Guess that's his specialty. Hmm. Not really too much, oh gosh, spiders! Spiders everywhere! There's been a lot of spiders in this game. There we go, that's lots of stuff. Lots of towels and stuff up that way. Seems like there's not much to interact with here. Maybe inside of, inside of this thing? No? It actually won't let me open it. Hmm. There might be something I could put the plunger on. If so, I'm not seeing it. Maybe on this drawer, because that one looks golden, but not really. Oh, there's something missing. Oh yeah, that's right, we're trying to look for the, gotcha. I thought there should be more to this room though, even then. But anyways, we'll get this figured out. 
and open it up, put the key inside. So this should have the final one we're looking for. There it is, the star! I got it, very cool. So what else is there? Nothing. This room feels very empty. What happened to that one ghost? Okay, we got some money in there. What is with this? Well, hold on. Maybe there's still another secret here. Or not. Let's try this one. Uh, not much. Okay then. Uh, I really guess that means there's nothing around here. So we're still missing two gems. Oh, here we go. <laughs> what are you doing? You're making a big mess. No, Goigi! Poor guy. It really is a big, big uh, problem. Him being unable to do anything with water. But anyways, we got the star key right here, but I don't know what's going on with that red ghost. I don't see too much more we can interact with. We've really cleared this place out, so I think we're just good to go up here. Oh no. Now that we've gotten accustomed to the escalators, we gotta use the steps, we're gonna be winded. Oh no, oh no. Come on Luigi, you can do it. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Oh, this is a problem. He's gotta get a little exercise and <laughs> Yikes. Never wanna run up the down escalator, that's just dangerous. What do we do about this? Oh no. Whoa, you're new. Looks like a thwomp in like ghost form. I like it. I mean, he looks a little different than the flop, but. Okay, I thought there were some ghosts to my side. Ow, she just tackled me. He definitely works like a thwomp or a womp. There's thwomps and then there's womps. So they're two different characters. Um, I think I gotta sneak behind him. Yep, he's got like two little tails. Uh, that's it, boom, got him. He has a lot of health to work through though. Gotta be careful, because he's gonna charge right at me. Also, the ghost scissors are back in there. You know what, he's probably a golden ghost. Uh, come on, that's it. But then, once again, I have to get behind him. Come on. Nice. There it is, awesome. Okay, well, we got it done. So the, the escalators are back to normal. He was quite an aggressive one, wasn't he? I'm surprised you were able to catch him. He'll be a big help to my research, though. Keep it the good work, okay? <laughs> I'm not doing a very good job at his laugh. Anyways, um, that does have me curious. First off, can I interact with this sprinkler? I guess I can't. What do I have to do to get this guy? I guess I just have to be quick. You see how maybe if I ran up to him right away, that would solve my issue? What happens if I leave and come back? He seems to be gone for now. I'll have to keep that in mind. Sorry I missed out on him if that's the case, but. You know, I'm doing what I can. So, you know, I might make Luigi yeah, go into the goop here because he doesn't even disappear for a minute. So with this key, hold on, what's this about? Aha, look at this. I think this is just a picture of money. But we might as well try it and get a lot of money. Definitely lots of cool stuff found in today's episode. But for right now, we need to take on this uh, patrol guy, the uh, oh no, for a second I thought this was disappearing, but then I remembered that we got rid of that. Uh -huh. We had to take out the mall cop. I will knock, knock. Maybe we shouldn't knock, because then you'll know we're coming in. Ah! <laughs> he gets scared more than Luigi does. Where is he going? Oh, he's getting out of here. <laughs> he's, at least he's trying. He's got an undercover mission going on. Oh, not the puffer fish, yeah. Don't throw that at us. Oh, the water gun. Oh, so we can't use Guiji here. But how are we gonna get past the bars without Guiji? Good question. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to explore this stuff after the boss fight, so I'm a little worried but I need to try some stuff out here. Uh, first do this. Oh, there's some money in here, but not really too much more. 
Um, let's try Gooigi now. Oh, there's some cash on the ground. Let's grab that really quickly and see if I can't go through. I can, he's gonna get scared, and we can get him. Oh, we gotta get rid of his sunglasses. Oh, Gooigi has his own health too. He's down to like five health, apparently. Oh, gotta dodge that. Now I can get him. Oh, you're in trouble now, buddy. Ooh, nice. There we go, making a big mess of everything. Where is he going now? Gotta be ready for him. So definitely we need to get rid of the sunglasses as soon as possible, and then we can get him. We made quick work that time. Okay, very cool. But he's not done just yet. I think we need to do that two more times before we take him out for good. Definitely go for this, the glasses right away if we flash him with the light. You just have to sort of be moving around a lot. If not, you're gonna hit that water, and that won't be good. Oh no, we got him, okay. <laughs> His tummy's too big. Come on, you got it. Good job, Gooigi. And there we go, another elevator button. Which number is this? I think it's number two? Yeah, good job. All right, so as you can see, it is number two. <laughs> Showing to Luigi, who is still napping. Huh? <laughs> I did it. Yeah, you did it, sort of. I mean, it was you. You're controlling Luigi, as far as I can tell. I mean, that's what uh, Professor Egad said. So what can I do about all this stuff? Like, there might be more around here, so I definitely wanna explore what I can while I can. Um, it might just be more money, which is great and everything. But at this point, we have so much money, and I was hoping that maybe we'd find a way to spend it. You know, if there was anywhere to spend it, it'd be a store, right? But uh, apparently not. Oh, a little guitar. What did that do? Um, I don't know if that's what I was supposed to do. It looked like I could maybe interact with it. Um, <laughs> whoops. Anyways, break whatever else I can find. Whoa, whoa, oranges? Lots of oranges, okay. Well, Luigi, if you need more vitamin C, you got it. And what about this one? So far, this is not really netting me very many results, but I gotta keep trying. And what about this? I cannot interact with this. Okay, so if there's nothing in this cardboard box, which there likely will not be, I think we're good to skedaddle. I'm, I'm super surprised we missed out on two gems, though, because I have no clue where they are. It seems like there should have been more to this room. But there definitely doesn't seem like anything much more I can do. Oh, what about this up here? Well, obviously that won't really help me too much because I wouldn't be able to vacuum it. Okay, well then I guess it's time to go. We tried our best. Uh, going shopping, Luigi? Now isn't really the best time for that. Hurry up and get that, wait, I thought I got the button. Oh, Gooigi had it. So now I need to pick it up from Gooigi, and now we can leave. Gotcha. So with that done, I mean, I guess we just gotta go back to the elevator. What more can we do? I've already explored this area, I feel, as thoroughly as I possibly could. The only real mystery is the one golden ghost down here. Is he back? I'll try him one more time if he's back. Oh, I just put Gooigi immediately in the water. I'm so sorry. Set him up for failure. There he goes. Okay, ready? I'm gonna go in. See, that doesn't work. I'm so confused. All right, oh well, I tried. I'm gonna leave you, Gooigi, I'm so sorry. What's weird is that, like, you know, he'll just sort of slowly zoom the screen out. There we go. And I don't see anything else we can really do this way. Because we've already been this way, I tried to get into here, didn't quite work, so I think that maybe there'll be more answers in a future episode. We'll have to wait and see. For right now, I'm done with this area. I had a lot of fun with it, for sure. I love how there seems to be a, like a boss fight to finish up each area so far. It's been a ton of fun with that regard. Um, but yeah, that was floor three mostly complete, and along with it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but number two. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, oh. One of these days, you'll have the chance to screw it in instead of it all doing it itself. So we now have one, two, three, and five. Luigi, the elevator can take you directly to lobby 2F. You might as well head that way and check it out, I say. Well, I would love to, but I think that's something I'm going to do in the next episode, the mezzanine. Yeah, we were at the hotel shops. Last episode, we were at the RIP suites. <laughs> um, 
And then next episode we'll do mezzanine. Mezzanine? I don't I don't know what that word means really. Uh, but I want to go back to Professor Egad because something I forgot to do at the end of last episode that I definitely want to do this episode is check out the um thing, the little thing where you can check the ghosts' names. Um, unfortunately, they don't provide descriptions in this game. I sort of wish that they did, but at the least I can check out um, their names and everything. Like I don't know what the, the, the uh, mall cop's name's gonna be. It's probably gonna be something obvious, but I don't know that until I go and find out. So let's go and find out. Yeah, definitely I'm having a lot of fun with the game recently, and I can't wait for plenty more episodes of having fun. It seems like there's a lot to accomplish in this game. It seems really huge. So, uh, let's go to the gallery real quick. Ah. Yep, gonna plug that in. Dump all of our info. So as you can see, there's info for ghosts and gems. When it comes to the gems, we've been making a lot more progress. Obviously, there's still a couple of things still to figure out, but I'm pretty happy with most of it. Anyways, next up, the ghosts. Um, we have 20 of goobs, we just got a hammer, is his name. And then these are mini goobs, that's cute. Uh, over this way for the rare ghosts, I don't think we have any. Oh wait, I wasn't done looking. Yep, no m rare ghosts, but we have the steward who we got in the first episode, Shambrea who we got in the second episode, and Crawler, huh, we got in the third episode, which is this one. So hopefully we'll get more boss ghosts. There's a ton. There's an absolute ton, so that is really exciting. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Luigi's Mansion 3. Before you go, be sure to comment Zebra Ghost so any of you watched at the end that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.